So what happens when you go this direction? Whoa. Alrighty, I got something funny to tell you. So Sean left to go to the church and work on um, some work stuff that he does. He never forgets his phone. He always takes his phone with him, like anywhere and everywhere he goes. So I've been texting him, nothing like too important or emergent or anything crazy like that. But he left his phone home. I was wondering why I didn't get any answers and his phone was on silent so I didn't know from the first text that his phone was sitting right here on the table. What? So I was trying to text Sean and just tell him that the video is done and that I'm going to go to the grocery store so we don't have to go later and blah 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 and all that sort of stuff. You don't really need to know everything that I said but yeah, that's basically it. And so I look over and I'm like, his phone lit up. His phone's on the table. <laughs> Bam the boo. Hey boo boo. Hi. Okay, my camera is being weird. It keeps telling me that I have no memory card. And memory card's in there and I'm filming. What is up with this? Well, we'll have to figure it out. I think this card might be on its way out because it's having a hard time going into a little slot thingy above around the computer. We got Lunitude. Hey Lou, you like the, you like, she likes this. And one day we know she's going to try and jump up there and swing it. And I want to film her doing it, but we don't always have our camera like out like that. So it'd be really hard to do. But there's Miss Lunitude. Hey Lou. Hey girl. Oh, hey, whoa. Be nice to the camera. Don't be mean to it. Oh, you guys love each other? Yeah, they just got to learn how to play with each other and not get super duper wild and hurt each other, huh? No hurting each other. Oh, you don't like the camera today, do you? Did you have a bad hair day today? Your hair looks the same every day, though. So weird. Whatever. You go outside, Mr. Boo? Here, let's show you how Mr. Boo goes to the bathroom. Well, not to the bathroom, but how he tells us that he needs to go to the bathroom. Bentley! Billy, push the, push the, come on Billy, can you go outside? Oh, ah, you spill your water everywhere. Ah. Oh my goodness, we're having issues here. Bentley, how did you get this down underneath there? Huh? Okay, show me how you want to go outside. How do you go outside? Oh yeah, you tell us when you go. Okay, we're going to take him outside, go potty, and I'm going to go to the grocery store and get a few things. It's hot outside. And it's only like 9.30 or maybe 10. I'm not sure, sure what time it is outside, but time outside. Is time outside and inside different? No, of course not. Anyway, I'm outside with Mr. Bentley Boo, and it's really hot out here already. I don't know what the actual temperature is, so we'll have to check it out. Millie, what are you doing? You go to the bathroom? Billy boy. You go to the bathroom? I don't know what he's doing. Anyway, let's check the temperature and see what time what the temperature is. It is currently 10:30 a.m. Temperature is hot, 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 hot. Very hot outside. It is currently 86 degrees outside. 86 degrees. I don't know if you can see that or not. Yep, 86. So it is supposed to get up to 100 degrees today, and tomorrow is supposed to be 102, and Monday 108. Just in case you wanted to know what the weather was going to be like. I don't like to have Bentley out here just sniffing around on the ground because we still got those foxtails and stuff. And we want to be very, very careful with these foxtails and make sure that he doesn't get into it. Because we don't want to have to have an emergency trip to the, the vet place. We have to keep a very good eye on him when he's sniffing outside. Because there's a lot of stuff out there that he shouldn't be into. I'm going to go to the store now get some stuff. We get stuff for lunch, and we're almost out of our um, Keurig coffee thingy bubbers. We we have a lot in here, but we have like a bunch of non-coffee stuff. It's pretty empty. We got a few things back there. This is all like non-coffee, and then this one's tea. So got to get a few more of those because we're enjoying it. We're enjoying all the different flavors of the creamer that we're drinking, and all that fun stuff. So I'm gonna go to the store, get a few things, put Mr. Bentley Boo in his crate. No, he's not going to be very happy, but that's where he's got to go. So, we'll see you later. Bye! Alright, so here's my haul from the store. It's nothing too special. 
All right, interesting. But here's what we got. Raspberry chocolate truffle. I think this is our favorite um, coffee that we've drinking. Our favorite coffee. Anyway, back to the, uh, the haul. I told you it wasn't anything exciting. So all we got here is the um, cookie, uh, cookies, oh my gosh. The coffee and a bucket. You say bucket? Why did we get a bucket? Well, this bucket is for Bentley. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put all of Bentley's toys in the bucket. So we're gonna walk around the house here and put his toys in there. There's one toy. We're gonna keep that one in there for him for now because he's in there. So I'm gonna look for his other toys. Let's turn on some lights because I see some toys in here. Toys, toys, toys. So we got this. And you say, why do you have a water bottle? Well, he likes to chew on it. So we let him chew on it because he needs stuff to chew on. So we got this and he's chewed on it quite a bit here. bucket a bucket for Bentley what do you think about that Bentley you like your bucket Bentley boy like his bucket uh -huh. yeah oh yeah Mr. Bentley boy Mr. Bentley boy Sean's still not here and his phone is still here so I've been checking his phone for messages making sure there's no like work stuff that needs to be done because then well I don't really know how I'd message him but at least I would know so I could tell him when he gets home but nothing cool's happened on his phone so far so I'm gonna make some Kool-Aid. So as you know, we have this Kool-Aid addiction. Not really. But we have all these Kool-Aids right here. And we've been making them and then we've been freezing them into little popsicles. So we've been enjoying those as little snacks at night. And it's like not too crazy of food, zero calories. So, well, I guess this is zero calories, but then you have all the sugar in there. So yeah. And then this is the sugar that I'm using. It's, I don't know if this one's organic or not, but this was the only one that they had in the store when we got it. But it's uh, something or other, you can't pronounce it, sugar, pure cane. So it's cane sugar, so it's close enough. We had organic last time. Anyway, I'm going to make some Kool-Aid. I already got the, the water in here. So let's make it. You want to join me? Sure. Why not, yeah. It's almost patriotic. It's blue, white, and red. Wow! Hey, Bentley. Hey, Boo. Bentley's on a road trip with us. Not really a road trip, but we're going to a friend's house. And they said we could bring Mr. Bentley Boo with us. Not a kind of them. Why are you being weird, Mr. Bentley Boo? I turned on the camera. Just you loves. I turned on the camera and he's being weird. He was like super calm the whole entire time. No, oh, he's just giving loves. And now he just he's like, what puppy. do I do? What do I do? He's a happy puppy. Sean has he's lots of stuff to say here. Happy puppy. Billy's happy puppy. <laughs> okay, we got some weirdos in the car. We've got Weirdo. Sean. They're both weirdos. I'm the only sane one in the car right now. Weirdos! Stop it. It's just me and the happy puppy. <sighs> I don't know what exit to take. I don't know either. <laughs> you kind of got to like get directions. Yeah. So we're in Red Bluff. We're going to our friend's house. We have forgotten how to get to their house. And Sean doesn't know which exit to take. We're international and like 80% if not more of our viewers have no idea where Red Bluff is. 
Well, Red Bluff is a tiny little town in California, and it is south, yeah, south, I didn't even think about it. It is south of our town. It's half an hour away from our house. And we got the river right here. So we're on a bridge, on a river. We're on a bridge. And I think we take this exit. So, so we're gonna take an exit, and we're gonna figure out where in the world we're going. Even though you guys know, don't know where we're going, we don't know either. <laughs> We kind of know, we just forgot. Yeah, that too. Bentley, what in the world are you doing? What are you doing, Mr. Bentley Boo? What are you doing? And I think I had the camera upside down, so if you have upside down footage. <laughs> Talk about weirdos. <laughs> <laughs> so what happens when you go this direction? Whoa, trippy. I think it, it still goes the right direction. Whoa. I think it still goes Whoa. the right direction. <laughs> Look, see, it's like that. I don't know. Is it going to be upside down when we edit it? I don't know. We're going to learn something weird. new with our camera. You are weird. I'm sure it hey, it's cool over. that I'm weird, right? What? I'm sure it did not flip over. Aww. I'm sure it's upside down when you do that. <laughs> so we got upside down footage. What are you thinking about that, Mr. Bentley Boy? Bentley Boy says, yeah, Jay, you recording not time. Okay, so we're going to go find the house. I'm gonna go hang out and show off Mr. Bentley Boo. Cause he's just so adorable, especially those beautiful green eyeballs. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna turn this off before you start leaking it. Uh, bye bye. Bye bye. Ah. No. <laughs>